today we will be discussing fall prevention. And I'm going to demonstrate how to do a reverse lunge. This video is for beginners and appropriate for people who have osteoporosis, neuropathy, or any reason that causes your balance to be poor. So I do recommend to set up with two chairs or two pieces of furniture next to you. So what happens if you're in a crowd of people and accidentally someone pushes into you and you fall backwards? Well, instead of falling backwards and cracking your head, you are going to train yourself to perhaps when you are pushed back for whatever reason, that leg is going to come right back and prevent a fall. So let's start by holding on to your chairs or your furniture, and we're going to take a small step back. We're getting used to shifting our weight behind us, bringing that leg back to prevent the fall. The next progression, one finger, on each chair and then without onto the chair. Now once you're able to do this and if your knees are good, the next progression would be to hold onto the chair, take one step back and bend both knees, bring your leg back to starting position, switch legs, you're on your toe on your back leg, bend both knees, and back to your starting position. Big step back. So this way we also strengthen the leg muscles, challenge our balance a little bit more. The next progression, one finger only, And once you're able to do this and feel that, that your balance is pretty good, you can start to take one hand off and then perhaps the other hand. As you get stronger, try to take a larger step back. You might even bring that back knee a little bit closer to the floor. And then just start looking side to side. Again, we want to just demonstrate how important your vision is to balance and how if somebody calls you, it can really throw off your balance, causing a fall. Unless you train and try to strengthen your muscles to prevent a fall. Let's add the arms. So we add the arms because oftentimes we're moving our legs, but we're also perhaps doing something with our upper body. So we're trying to make these exercises as close to real life as possible so that when you are in these situations, you've trained your body how to react. So keep practicing these exercises and hopefully by doing this video a few times a week, it will help you prevent falls. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel, Carol Michaels Fitness.